Hi, it's me from the future. I'm just letting you know before this vlog starts, I know I talk a lot, a lot about light bulbs. But that's just because I'm super happy to have more light in this apartment. The lights that were here were dying. So just thought I would let you guys know. And yeah, let the vlog begin. <laughs> I know a lot of this right now, so let me go fix that. Okay, that now we look a little bit more presentable, I think. I thought I would just start another vlog just because I felt like it. Still has yellow hair, kind of a little bit better here, but yeah. So ignore my low pony, just really felt like it today. I am, um, I'm watching the first season of Rain. A friend of mine recommended it and so far so good. But it is Thursday, I think. Yeah, Thursday. And I really want to have a coffee, but I was like... So the reason I started vlogging is because I'm gonna show you guys how I make my iced coffee. So I have about 10 ice cubes. I just have them in these tray fill this up then i have some of this barista syrup type thing just got it I got it at the grocery store i don't really have an exact measure i just pour then i'm just using coffee i cannot for the life of me remember the name of them but the capsules are yellow um if i can find a picture of it i will put it up here so yeah so i have ice cubes the syrup and the coffee so, I have made various versions of iced coffee and I find it the best vegan milk, the best dairy free milk is the, I think I might have bought a wrong one. So I usually use this one, which I love, it's almond and hazelnut, which, oh my god, best combination ever. But I do not want to open this one, this is brand new, so I'm gonna use the one that I already opened. And this is just almond. And I just pour until I can't pour anymore. Please. It's so much sweeter, but it's not sweet. And there's my iced coffee. Okay, it's the next day. Okay, I'm watching Despicable Me 2. I was supposed to watch it yesterday, but I fell asleep. Anyways, I'm vlogging right now because I fixed this. Whoop, whoop. Shouldn't really be sitting on a couch. But the thing is that it is more vlog worthy per se. I have always. Okay, maybe not. Okay, if I just do something about the lighting, then we're all Gucci. But I have I have figured out that this lighting is horrible. I can probably fix it a little bit. But I have found out that every single spotlight in this apartment is like really old. So because this light went out and then how the one right about the kitchen is out, one in the bathroom and then one in the bedroom is also completely out. So I need to buy new ones. They are fairly expensive. I, was like, just, I took this out the other day. They just look like this. I don't know. I've been looking for a really long time. I think ever since I started the last vlog for new ones, but like they're so expensive. Like, why? And then I went to this store and I was just like, okay, I'm just gonna go in the lim I'm gonna be buy two. I can have one in the kitchen and then one in my living room. And if they don't fit, then I can just return them. I have the receipt. But they fit. That's better. This is the old one. Then we have... These are the new ones. So I just think that the ones that are here already are really old and when I'm vlogging it's really really orange. Not that I'm like, oh I have to have like white lights and stuff like that but because I'm vlogging I want to have it because it looks way way nicer even if I want to take like Instagram pictures and stuff like that. It's gonna look way way better. Basically that is it. So if you're wondering, probably not. But the thing is I was really worried too, like watts and stuff. If you are wondering, like I was really really worried about the lighting and just everything. But this is the information. If you can't see it then I will try to link it below or write it down below. As you can see the difference between here, maybe not the best example, but I'm a little bit more yellow over here. Especially over here when I'm editing and the camera doesn't look that bad. But when I'm editing, trust me. Especially at like night time. So I do, I don't think I have the time to change that one over there. But I will do that tomorrow and I perhaps will vlog that. I'm just really, really happy. Like look how bright it is over there compared to what it was. I think I have some old vlog footage of me vlogging. You can find it out and start it here. If not, then just I will pro probably link a video down below where I'm walking through from the bedroom to out here which I'm like, oh, I want to sit on the couch and I'm gonna put on my shoes and I'm gonna vlog and there's like complete darkness and the lights were like at its fullest I love being independent like, hello I'll see you guys tomorrow real realistically and I'm gonna be, I do not want oh god, I can't talk 
I'm not gonna pick up the camera till tomorrow. So, okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay, I'm aware that it is very, very dark, but I am uh, in the process of changing my lines. I don't know if I wanna do all of them today. I'm super duper tired. I'm not entirely sure why I'm just really, really tired. Let's see. I bought four more of the light bulbs that I need. I don't think I'm gonna be filming. I don't know if you can even see it. Okay, I'm totally zooming in on the wrong one. Battery's dying, so I'll see you guys when I'm when I have changed everything. And we're back. You know the mess in the background. I haven't done much today. It's actually Sunday. It's two days later than what I like wanted to vlog, but yesterday didn't really do much and but as you can see lighting is like ten times better right now. Like hi. I had Dinner. I think I have some really old like vlog clips of me walking through here. You can barely see me. Now when I'm vlogging, you can see me. I just thought I would update on that and then tomorrow picking up my hair looks no not the best. Tomorrow I'm picking up a package for my computer. I do have hold on. I have oh my god, you can like see how much I've used them. I have a MacBook Air and one of the really first first things that I bought for it was this protector right here and it's nothing wrong with the protector it works really really fine it's black it's simple it is what I like but I went on all the express and just was looking because I'm the type of person who likes to change up stuff so I was like maybe there are some cheap ones and maybe it won't work I will, obviously I will show you guys when I get it I was expecting this package to arrive this week and then I got a text or message from my postal office that the package was too big for my mailbox, which I can understand that this will be too big for it. I have friends in the background, if you can hear that. I'm sorry, but really not sorry. Also, I don't know if this will make it in the vlog, but I bought new bedding. You can, in here is like, what even is this lighting? But I bought new bedding. Really excited about that. Okay, I'm hoping that this is okay. So, I just picked up the package that I needed to pick up. It is a MacBook case for my MacBook, obviously. In here, let me just go get something to like. I had to get a knife. It was very well packaged. I like this product. I will leave a link down below so you can purchase this yourself. So I didn't think it would come with this um, at all, but it comes with this which is for your keyboard, but I don't know, I don't think it smells so strong, but I don't think it will fit my keyboard. I didn't think that, but as you can see, I have a Norwegian keyboard. If you are Norwegian, or if you have like two extra letters or whatever, um, I would definitely leave the link for this down below. Okay, so this is the bottom piece. It looks very much like this bottom piece. So I think I'm just, I think I'm just gonna be changing the top one, which by the way, I had a lot of problems putting other case I have on. I had a lot of problems with it. Okay, like 10 minutes later, I have it off. Woohoo! So, this is the old one, this is the new one. My question is like, okay, will the will the Apple, Apple logo light through this? That's my question. Um, it is super simple to like, I think, if I remember correctly. It is super simple to like put on. All you have to do is click it in place. And there we have it. Woohoo! I'm a little unsure if I want to change the back. Click it into place. Okay, I'm in my bra. I just showered and I figured I would show you guys like my makeup routine. I don't really use much, but first thing I did, like I washed my face and everything and then I put on um, some the uh, Daily Essentials Sunstick Day Cream. I've been using this for a year now and I have to say it's one of the best I've ever had. Then I just put on put on this primer spray by Kix. Then I use this in instant anti age eraser concealer by this concealer right here, and it is in the shade 01 light. Then I'm just using one of these W7 Uni blenders.
I'm sorry if the lighting isn't like perfect, but you know, we work with what we got. So, I have been at work all day and I've been waiting for this package. Oh my god, since I ordered it. I ordered it. Oh my god, I can't talk. I ordered it like a week ago. And it's Crush Factory, by the way. It's piercings for my nose. I do have these two. Um, I used to have a lot more, um, but I don't know where they are. I didn't order a whole bunch of stuff, I just ordered a few pieces. I'm gonna show you Baranga, because I feel like this vlog is me showing you guys what I got like every now and then, but I ordered, oh my god, maybe tomorrow I'm gonna try them all on, but I have to like sterilize them, and they're not. First piece are these, I will link them down below by the way if you are interested. You can't really tell and I don't want to put them, like take them out of the bag either. But I'll show you guys better tomorrow. But I got some, I think these are called the screws. They have like a black diamond and then I have another one that is like totally normal or regular ones. They look like this. And I also ordered one for my ear because as you can see I have these. Two. I have a hole here, but I don't have a piercing for it. So I bought another one of those. Then I bought two of, of these. And then I also ordered, this is something I kind of wanted for a little while now. They are just, it's, they're called, they're no studs. They are clear. So if for one day I'm like, I just want to show one of my piercings. I can just pop these in. Or if I don't want them to show at all, I can pop these in. This is all that I ordered and obviously I will link everything down below and then I'll show you guys tomorrow what they will look like. I just really want to show you guys. Also, it's been a really long day. I've been at work all day and I'm super, super tired. So I'm just gonna sterilize these and then probably eat, obviously, because I need something to eat before I go to bed and then I'll go to bed. But what I wanted to show you is how I sterilize. They are kind of, they say they are sterilized, but I just want to be certain that they are. So I'm just going to use some cotton pads. Then I have this alcohol gel. And I have this, which I love. And I'm just going to, you can't even tell, but I'm just going to pop some on there and then put the patient in the solution. And I'm sure a lot of people have like ways that they do it. This is just how I personally do this. Excuse the mess. This is where um, I'm gonna be leaving them overnight. And I am, I can vlog without it being dark. And I'm gonna eat and I'll see you guys hopefully tomorrow. I hopefully will vlog tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Okay, so I thought I would just finish this vlog because I have edited what you just saw obviously and i thought i would just finish up i'll show you guys something that i bought earlier this week it's currently sunday right now and so i have i have had this vlog finished for like a week now but i've been too busy i've been doing too not too much but i'm doing a lot of stuff this week and i haven't had the time to actually vlog or edit at all so on monday i got a new tv and the tv that i got is something that i have been wanting to get for a real long time i just haven't actually like I'm doing it now. I am I'm the type of person who is I want to do research. I want to know that I am actually making like a good purchase. I want to know that you know I'm not going to regret buying it. And when you're buying a TV you should invest. So you should spend some sort of not just a little bit but you should put like money into buying TV. So let me say over here. So the TV that I have bought is a Sony Bravia smart TV. It just looks like this. I don't know. And I have two speakers. I was like, you know what? These speakers aren't justifying the sound quality that I want to have. So I had to buy, what's it called? It's like a sound bar. Is that what is the right term for it? Yeah, I think so. So I had to buy that. The brand for it is Amadeus or something like that. But I will leave a link down below for both the TV and the soundbar. I'm pretty, pretty pleased with it. I've had the TV for like around a week now. It's Sunday and I got it on Monday. And I have to say, I am very, very happy with it. The TV that I used to have, it is five years old. So this is my old TV. Ignore the trash. Um, I've been cleaning all day, but this is the old TV. It's a Luxor. It's a flat screen. It's a 32 inch flat screen. Love this TV. That TV has been with me for like five years now, I think. 
I've been cleaning the apartment all day. I've been like from top to bottom. Now my room looks like this. I have changed bed sheets to, to this. I love marble, so like why not? This is still the same. I've cleaned out this. I had to take out that from my table because I'm using my table as my TV stand. Don't worry, I'm buying a new one. I just have to find a time for it. These are still the same. This is my yoga mat, which, you know, when I work out, I use this. My desktop is very clean right now, which I love, which is, it's not gonna stay clean for very long. My kitchen is clean as, you know, you can have it, really. Um, I know there's a lot of trash over there. Not trash, but like dishes. But you know, when you need to do dishes by hand, it's always gonna be dishes. Like I've done dishes, I did dishes on Friday and I did a lot of dishes today. It's just, what's the word? In an envelope, in an envelope, I don't know. Clean the floors, cause you know, you have to do that. I am currently drying pillowcases. This, the couch is still the same, but I have to show you this. So I got this a couple of days ago and it's something for you know your remote controls if you have you know your ipad extra cords that you want to like hide or whatever you can put them in here i've been doing a, l a lot of laundry like a lot of laundry i think I'm on my like fourth load right now. I first had to do my work clothing, but I am feeling really, really, really blessed that I am able to buy a new TV, buy a sound bar. I don't know what else to like talk about. I'm also I'm trying to get my Instagram to like be more poppin', so follow me. I'm trying to get better at like posting photos, better at actually making my photos look somewhat decent. I have actually invested in it. I have, if you know Karen Swan from KK and Baby J, which I've been following in them for like a couple of years now she recently came out with presets for your lightroom app which is this app where you can edit photos and stuff like that so i bought her presets there they are 25 dollars in my opinion it's fair rising i've used the presets on a couple of my photos this being one of them and this is the other one which I'm very happy with. I love these presets. The preset that I purchased was a light one. There is a light preset and then a dark preset. By the way, a little update on my, on like the MacBook case I got. Um, 10 out of 10 would recommend. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I know it wasn't the most interesting, but it's my life. My life isn't that interesting. So I don't know what to do. Maybe make it interesting. I don't know, maybe sort of belonging in public. Oh god, no. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this vlog, and I will see you guys in my next one.